Today is one of the hardest days of my life. It was like things was going okay and then the next thing I know, just like that, he's gone. My dad is gone. My dad is gone. The clock has stopped on his life. I pulled it together, spent the week planning his home going. He loaded outside, and with the cool temps, I made the thing fall. I figured he'd like that. For 36 months, I was by my dad's side. My dad and I was really close. We did a lot of things together. Lots of fishing, building and creating things outside. We just loved spending time together. He was one of my best friends outside of my mom. He was winning, always beating cancer. One day we were sitting on the porch and a couple of days later he was gone. I feel so lost inside. Gardens have went neglected. Dishes have went undone. Laundry is unfolded. The depression just keeps taking over and winning. So many things have went neglected. It's just like, once I lost my dad, my whole entire world just stopped. Like everything stopped. I couldn't move, I couldn't breathe, I couldn't eat, I couldn't sleep, I couldn't function. I mean, it's like I don't know what to do. It's feel like I was, I'm just lost in the world. I've even doubted if God even existed. Like, why would he do this? Why would he bring us so forward just to leave us? But I talked to my mom and a the therapist. And I realized I have to keep my faith in God. And at the end of this storm, there's a light to this darkness. In some kind of way, I have to push through. My dad is going to be expecting me to take care of everybody. So it's time to get up. It's time to pull it back together. Let the light in and get back on track. No matter how hard it hurts. No matter how much I miss him. No matter how much I want to hear his voice. I gotta move on and make him proud. I love you, Dad. And I miss you so much. So I'm going to get up. Put up the tree. Put the Halloween decor on it for the grandkids. And I'm going to stick to everything that I said that we were going to do. I'm going to build everything that I said we, that we said we were going to build. And I'm going to make you proud. I love you. Custom sheds and cabins, sour crop and slog them last. Yeah, one closed when we come back to somebody there.